Now that we have PHP CS installed, we're ready to start sniffing, but what if your app uses WordPress? Wouldn't it be great if you could follow along with their coding standards too? Well, you can, because they also have a PHP CS rule set. Now, what's a rule set? A rule set is a set of sniffs that looks for things that are wrong um, and tells you about them so that you can fix them. So if we go to GitHub and, and look up the WordPress coding standards, um, let's take a look at a rule set. Um, the WordPress VIP, we'll go in here. Here's a rule set. Here's a bunch of instructions for PHP CS to follow. Now your rule set is what tells PHP CS what to do. To get these rule sets on your computer, you're gonna have to use Git. So um, this video kind of assumes that you have Git installed and we're gonna install it as a standalone so that you can use this globally. All right, let's uh, go ahead and copy and paste this command, which is just git clone, the master branch, and we're gonna put it in the WPCS folder. So I'm in my home directory. I have a special folder in my home directory called utilities. So I'm just gonna CD into utilities. Yep, I have a couple of folders already in there, but let's go ahead and copy and paste and let's clone the WordPress coding standards onto my computer. Great, the WordPress code standards are now in my utilities folder. So now I have to tell PHP code sniffer to go look at these rule sets. And to do that, we're gonna run this command. It's called PHP CS. We're gonna tell it, hey, I wanna set some configuration. Specifically, I want you to point at a new path. All right, let's do it. Copy, paste, and I'm gonna update this path to the path where I just cloned the WordPress coding standards, which is my home directory, utilities, and WPCS. As you can see, the config value was installed and added successfully. So if I type phpcs-i, you'll now see I have all of the WordPress coding standards available via the command line on phpcs. Up next, I'm gonna talk about how to install a custom rule set and then later we'll do an annotated rule set.